Hello and welcome to the channel. If you're struggling with stuttering with PC VR gaming with your Quest 2, I'm going to show you a quick fix that should correct this for you. And um, this may be something you may experience if you have Windows 11. This is something I found out when I upgraded to Windows 11 very recently. Windows 10, I had no problems. My gaming PC is very strong. I have an RTX 3090. So I know it wasn't performance to do with my hardware and it was a clean install of Windows 11. So this is actually quite a common problem and there is a quick fix for it, guys. So first thing you need to do is go to your C drive, your boot drive, and we want to find the programs folder and then go in there and then we want to find the Oculus folder from here. And then go to support and we want the diagnostics folder, Oculus diagnostics. So there you go, take a note of that. And what we want is the Oculus Debug Tool XE. Uh, you may want to make a, um, a shortcut on your desktop for this because you will need this in the future. So first thing you need to do is just uh, launch it and then go to Service and Toggle Console Window Visibility and just let that do its thing. So let's click Yes and it will restart the Oculus client and you'll get this window coming up. And um, you can effectively ignore this guy, just leave it running. Um, but when you have this open, it seems to fix the problem, the stuttering problem. I do not want to know why, but it does do it. And one does wonder why Oculus has not fixed this. So make sure you don't minimize it. So just leave it on your desktop and just get on with your gaming and you'll find that you will have stutter-free gaming after that. Um, so yeah, amazingly quick fix, um, and that's all you need to do. So if you do have a kind of issue where you're still having stuttering, just alt-tab to it, make sure you click on that window, and you'll find it should fix it. But generally speaking, as long as it's just on the desktop doing its thing, you should be fine. Uh, the other thing I did discover occasionally is um, if your headset does freeze, uh, if you just go to the window and just press return, it'll kind of just resume, and it'll just sort of sort itself out. So. That's all you need to worry about, guys. Um, and to get rid of the window after you finish your session, you will need to actually just go back to the Oculus Debug tool and then just close it by uh, toggling the console window visibility once more. And that will turn it off for you. And uh, simple as that. Anyway, guys, hope that helped you. Um, yep, I'll be back soon with something new. So uh, stay tuned and I'll see you in the next one. Take care and bye-bye.